Hello everyone. Welcome to the demo for uh, Goodbye Volcano High. This game is going to be very loud, just so you know. Uh, <laughs> bugs, right? Characters. You know, your decisions, right? Make a choice. Right? No pressure. See you at school. So, I warn you, it's probably going to be loud. Um, until I can turn it down. Uh, I'm gonna... okay. Scientists announced today the discovery of a previously unobserved asteroid, estimated to be roughly 10 kilometers in diameter. Designated CO103, the object shows a rather high possibility of entering the solar system and a non-insignificant chance of collision with the planet. Astronomers were quick to add that very little is known about the orbit and speed of the asteroid in these early stages, and trajectory predictions are very likely to change as more data is collected. That's right, Mary. Though we know very little, scientists say the asteroid's electromagnetic atmosphere may cause some minor interference with electronics. And we'll be right back after this commercial break. Yo, no way, Omi was right. My asteroid takes us all out. Best way to go in my honest, in my opinion. Yeah, he's it as an excuse. Act like assholes. They need an excuse. Not fighting anyone over. Let's get a corn. Just end it. Wow, a lot of living in a historically significant time period. That was fast. tell you I like you like a lot <laughs> oh no this is weird because you don't know who I am I just need to get it out <laughs> right <laughs> I just want to let you know I like you the world's gonna end yay <laughs> so what the fuck Incidents. <laughs> Happy it is sad. <laughs> Come on down here now. I don't know. <laughs> Seems related. <laughs> Some question. I just got a text from someone saying they're in love with me and telling me no. I guess we might all die soon or whatever, so... What should I do? What? <laughs> so exciting. Also... Why didn't I get you the text? <laughs> Love you, Sage. We turn off cats. <laughs> I bet it's real. Energy is wild right now. Who is it? Oh, it's a random phone number. <laughs> oh, 
let's see. Ooh. <laughs> Secret admirer. Last right content. Wait. <laughs> so we get right now short. <laughs> you didn't know what to call the thing that's about to destroy the entire planet. Ooh, good question. Let me look it up. <laughs> no. It's already a meme page. This is pretty funny. People are weird. I don't understand this world. Neither do I. <laughs> Should check in with the band. <laughs> okay, we'll see you at practice tomorrow. At least we know what's still happening. Okay, it's an asteroid. Not near, so no one know. <laughs> Big brain. Peaches and stars. <laughs> the heck? It's internet safe. Bring it on. Oh god. Hear the news? No. Did something happen? I've been in a deep meditative trance for the past two hours. Okay, okay. I was just checking in. There's nothing to be upset about yet. Tell that to Naomi. She's been texting me asteroid facts, and they are high octane nightmare fuel. Sounds like Naomi. You know, every fact she sends me has been cross checked with at least three verified sources. Kind of hard to dismiss. Let me hear some. Well, okay. For a start, this is the biggest object to get this far into the solar system in... in... ever. Yikes. Good thing it's not gonna hit us, then. Yeah. Seriously? It's not. There's already memes about it, and that means it'll be over in, like, a month. Yeah? Yeah, no, you're right. Thanks. Trust me. <coughs> you staying up? <coughs> No. Gonna head to bed. Okay. Okay. Me too. Good night. Night. <sighs> it's gonna be fine. It's senior year. Just gotta make it to the summer tour. It's so loud. I'm gonna try to turn it down. Um... Once again. Okay. Hey, Bing. What? We're worried about the calendar. It says days for numbers. Okay. So, like, a dino in here to you. Shut up. <laughs> you know, if we're twins, hello? Would be a pair of tactiles. Please stop. Hey, no. <laughs> uh. <laughs> okay. And communities all across the continent reacted to the news of a previously unknown space object this morning. Damn, enough about the asteroid. Yeah, that's a good call. I might be obsessing. When did you start listening to Pangea this morning? Pangea. I thought the goal is to not turn into dead. Uh, <coughs> I have my own reasons to stay informed. I'm on the debate team. I'm class president. And dad could never pull off this outfit that I'm totally crushing. It was so very loud. The silence is nice. We don't need to fill it. Definitely not. Except you have something to say. No. No. Well, hey, hey could I run something by you? Fine. So today, big day, class president's speech at the assembly. In light of the whole space rock potential demise of civilization thing, my chosen theme feels off. What's the theme? 
using this year to, um, make an impact? <laughs> and? Oh. Right. Impact. I use it 542 times in a 1,000 word speech. I even had a section where I rhymed every sentence with impact. You're describing a poem, and I think having a poem inside <coughs> your speech is your real problem. We have to act. Let's make this pact. Our goals can become fact. Please stop. It was a bit. No, I have to change it. Yeah, it's just too weird. Can I run some ideas by you? Please help me. You're gonna be fine. I mean, no one even listens to those speeches anyway. Seriously, please. You're so comfortable on stage and I don't know how you do it. And I want to be that way. Okay, here's what I'd suggest. You've got a... Avoid talking about it. No one wants to be thinking about the asteroid right now. Just keep it light. Won't that seem a little fake? It might, but the alternative is to bum everybody out. We already have to sit through assembly, and that's bad enough as it is. Harsh, but fair. Thank you. You give pretty good advice sometimes. Wow, I have never been to school this early. You mean on time? Oh, well, good luck today. Thanks. And you'll be there. I'll just focus on you and the audience. <laughs> yeah. Assembly? I can't remember the last time I actually went to that. See? It'll be a fun new thing for you. Plus, you'll get all the hot intel on Senior Picture Day. Woohoo! I turned it down and it's so very loud. <laughs> what are you doing here? You being up this early feels... wrong. Wait, blink twice if you're a mimic. <laughs> new year, new me. Okay, but if you join debate club or something, I'm getting you some help. Hmm, fair. Okay, okay, everybody. Lots of assembly energy happening right now. I kind of like it. Oh, are they still doing that? I don't know. The whole apocalypse thing really puts talking about Pizza Fridays in a different light. I was just going to go chill on the roof. You are obsessed with going up there. You're above and inside, on the outside. It's awesome. <laughs> Not with drama. Let me be clear. You got talent. This gig, you'll have to play something new, something for your owner. Have your audience. This shit's okay. I'm trying to help. Um. So, uh, I have some scary news. Gosh, you think she could write a nice text for once? Um. Uh, what should I say back? I mean, that will be there? Wait, there's a gif I think is perfect. Ah, uh, not helpful. <laughs> <coughs> Thanks, LJ. Won't be disappointed. <laughs> I think this means she's rooting for us? We're gonna get in? Or she's telling us not to get our hopes up. <laughs> Downer. Let's just be positive, okay? <sighs> Emergency band meeting. We need a plan for the audition. So, meeting on the roof? Oh my gosh, get over the roof! Perfect, let's go. Wait a minute, don't we have like a week till the audition? Exactly! You're gonna love the view up there. Hello. Oh, uh, yeah, hello. Okay, turn it down more. <laughs> wow. Yeah, this is pretty great. Right? Peaceful. 
<laughs> no thanks. I quit. My voice. Anyway, the bad news. About the giant rock that's gonna kill us all? Yeah. We heard. We need new songs for the audition. Seriously though, I got like no sleep thanks to the news. What if it's real? I mean, it's probably definitely real. So, like, it could be just as bad. They never even tell us if we were all toast. I just spent hours on homework when I could have been, I don't know, some fun bucket list thing. <laughs> yeah, exactly. As if school could get any more pointless. And we can still win Battle of the Bands, asteroid or not. Really? Should we even practice at a time like this? Or should we throw off the shackles of capitalism and bound into a life of freedom and hedonistic self-indulgence? <laughs> Hell yeah, Trish. Let's do the music thing, thanks. Which, again, is why we're up here. To talk about the songs. So that'd be, what, three new ones? That's a lot, dude. That's a lot. I have this project with Rosa and a test already happening in calculus Plus babysitting again, and my sister's birthday. Uh, you can keep your part really simple. And, and she said all the songs, but maybe only two. Same level of doable. Not happening. Just one? I can't. Unless you want to play by yourself. Fine. Ooh. Let's just play an old song in, like... A new way. Ugh, they're so embarrassing. Wow, okay, sorry. Yikes. Rude. No, ugh, I didn't mean it like that. <laughs> I just want to write about bigger things now. Our old stuff is about big things. <coughs> but sorry. you could change some of it, I guess. Works for me. Let us know when you're done. Well, maybe we can all pick one at lunch. Sure, sure. I gotta go. To my locker, but in a shady way. Because <laughs> I have a terrible secret today. <laughs> oh boy. Trish was being weird, right? Before? I don't know. Was she? Uh, are you okay? You've come into this year kind of intense with the band stuff. What's up? The band is important. Why did she have to just leave? I said it was an emergency. You did? And it is. To you. <sighs> so I was being weird. Shit. Sorry, I just... It feels like we really have a chance. I bet this would be a good spot to be if it hits. The asteroid? I'd rather not spend my last moments at school, actually. It's weird how everyone's acting like nothing is different. Like, to me, everything feels different now. Even though it's just a maybe? Yeah, I don't know. It's like once something may or may not happen, you can't stop thinking about it. And that's like the rest of my life all of a sudden. We're going on tour with the band. You, me, Trish, a van with our name on the side. Nothing has changed. The fan would be pretty sick. So, you know how we all play legends and lore, right? An ITM? Yeah. I'm joining this weekend, right? You are. Yes. Anyway, I've been playing LNL since I was like eight years old. I know the game better than anyone in this whole school. It sucks when the people you want to share it with aren't as interested. So. I get it, but I don't know if a lot of other people do. <laughs> LNL. <coughs> Dungeons and Dragons stuff. It's funny. Oh god. I cut off all of a out of nowhere. The sudden quiet. <laughs> it's like, what the fuck? <laughs> Time to assemble. Good luck with that. Catch me up on whatever I miss. About the yearbook dance or whatever. You're not coming? 
<laughs> no. I gotta do some invoicing and some L&L planning. Wanna ditch with me? Well, Trish isn't there, so... Meteor hits. I think I have a fresh move. <laughs> She's a lot. Can I fit all these people? They're just ones with faces. Some shit went down last night. Since I got so far, you went all near me and the haze. Very cool. See her bad side. Country tryouts at school. It's nice, but should we leave us to be the boring person in high school? Uh, quiz, class, will be cool. Mine, binary, title, solidarity, wherever. Uh, daily carnage, swan. I don't know if I'm talking about it, tends to be super <laughs> Wait, is she not binary? Oh. <laughs> non binary solidarity. Okay. Whatever. <laughs> but. Issue. Tessa. Hatch or neg. I'm set business plan. Oh god. Sorry. Oh, fuck. Oh, yes, print. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Oh, No, I'm fine here. Makes perfect sense. <laughs> She's kind of cute. <laughs> yeah. Look at... Is it weird that they're friends now? Like... All that bug stuff? <laughs> Yuck. What are the odds that two people would be so into all that? Ooh, yes, she... and oh God. hi, I'm Naomi, and I'm here to remind you that the yearbook club is still <coughs> looking for members. I know I want to remember this year forever. So you can join and be part of making our memories last a lifetime through good design. And speaking of yearbook, don't forget senior pictures are coming up. Um, uh, so some good tips for taking good photos can be found on the yearbook club website at... Okay. Well, uh, okay! Thanks! That's gonna haunt her. That's the kind of memory that'll follow you to the grave. <laughs> because, if I may, no matter what enters our orbit, we can't let that distract us from what's important, like friends. What we can mean to each other. Staying positive. Works every time. <clears throat> and Trish is happy. Like, genuinely. We barely talk anymore. In conclusion, maybe the rock will hit us, and maybe probably it won't. But either way, we will still have each other. Kind of. Okay, and that's my perfectly crafted plug for the big dance. So, end of the year, mark your calendars, prep your moves. That's it for me. You've been great, Volcano High. Please don't post any videos of this, like, anywhere ever. Thanks. <laughs> They're okay. Yeah! Woo! <laughs> <coughs> I'm 
said it. Okay. I guess that was it. Uh. <laughs> Hold on. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> this ends at that. I'm, I'm excited about this game. I really am. Like, I really want to play this when it comes out, but Jesus Christ, I hope they add a volume option. Like, something to change the audio. Because, holy crap, that's so loud. Ugh. But yeah, that was good. I I liked it. Um, I noticed that some some options, uh, like there were some options I picked and it went let me pick that option. And it was like kind of forcing my hand to choose the other option. Like it would only go halfway and it, it wouldn't continue. I was like, dude, what the heck is going on? Why I, uh, can't I pick this option? And it just kind of forced my hand to pick you know, the better option, like, there wasn't really any kind of choice to pick another one, like, I tried to, like, say earlier, I tried to say text that person back and say something, and it wouldn't let me choose that option, so, it feels kind of like it's supposed to be, like, you can pick what you want to do, but, yeah, it kind of forced my hand to not choose to text them back, you know, it kind of forces your hand to you know, have these options, but then it's like, it forces you to, to make this choice that you didn't want to make, and you know, it's not really like, you know, it's like, oh, you can't choose this, you have to choose the other option, it's like, what, what's the point of choosing what, uh, you know, of picking what you want to do then, like, what, what's the point of making these choices if you're just gonna force my hand to you know, pick this other choice, you know, so, <coughs> other than that, you know, I can't wait till this game comes out, yeah, um, like, it's kind of weird for it to just end like that, as, as the demo just kind of end at that, the assembly and shit, trying to give you, like, a small taste of what's gonna happen, but, yeah, um, I don't know, there's two ways this game can end, the game can end with the asteroid actually hitting the planet, and, the other way this game could end, and that would be like a super depressing ending. You know, you go through all this, you have all these characters, you get to the ending, and it just asteroid hits the end. <laughs> the other way this could end is if they get like a uh, the asteroid doesn't hit, and it comes close enough to you know hit the be uh, almost hit the planet, but miss. And that could be like the second ending and have like the sort of kind of, you know, happy ending like, uh, where we actually get to see what happens to the characters after, you know, the asteroid happens. Um, I don't know. I mean, that's two endings I could think of with this game, uh, happening like, you know, there's two different things, ways this game could go. You go like happy kind of like. You know, everyone has a happy ending, and they are just kind of sad. Everyone dies in the end, but hey, at least you got to know them, and you know, <laughs> uh, yeah, uh, I'll see you guys next time. Bye.